Well, if you're planning to become pregnant or if you've just recently found out this exciting news, it can be tough to know what all you need to do for you and your, for your baby. In tonight's Baby Your Baby report, Christina Flores explains the most important steps you can take to have a healthy pregnancy. A few months beforehand, the things to really focus on are just exercise, make sure you're in really good physical shape. Before you become pregnant, exercise can help prepare your body for the upcoming nine months. Also important pre-pregnancy, folic acid. This should be taken prior to conception as well as during pregnancy. It's been shown to prevent certain types of birth defects, specifically neural tube defects like spina bifida. Even if you're not planning to become pregnant, it's a good idea to take folic acid daily. Over 50% of births in America are unintended. Once you find out the exciting news, be sure to talk to your provider and start prenatal care. During a low-risk pregnancy, initial visits will be about once a month, making sure everything is on track. If you come in for prenatal care, then we can identify complications earlier and take care of them before they become a real problem. During pregnancy, a woman can continue normal lifestyle behaviors with the exception of a few important items. It's alcohol and, and tobacco are things that should be definitely be avoided during pregnancy. One thing women should keep doing is exercise. Any type of exercise that a woman's doing before pregnancy, I think she can continue through pregnancy. Dr. Olson says women who exercise during their pregnancy seem to have easier pregnancies, easier births, and easier recoveries. Lastly, pay attention to the food going into your body. Good nutrition is always important. If a woman's eating well, then that seems to contribute to her overall well-being also. Christina Flores, 2 News. After giving birth, Dr. Olson encourages women to enjoy their time with their new baby, but to also maintain social connections. This, along with getting up and being active, can be very healthy for the brain.